In this model, there is a stenosis in this part of the LAD. A usual balloon will easily pass through this lesion, but if the balloon is slightly inflated, the relative degree of stenosis will be so severe that the balloon will have trouble passing through. Simply pushing the balloon will not allow the balloon to pass through the lesion because the guiding catheter will be pushed back by the reaction. In such cases, for example, opening the balloon at the stent site of the circumflex stabilizes the guiding catheter. Pulling back the balloon of the circumflex provides strong backup for the guiding catheter. Using the anchor balloon technique like this, it is possible to advance the balloon into a severe stenosis. Once again, the anchor balloon technique is shown. To reiterate the basic principle of the anchor balloon, it is possible to easily increase the backup force of the guiding catheter by pulling back the anchor balloon. The increased backup force of the guiding catheter allows balloon passage for severe stenosis. Grip the guide wire and anchor balloon firmly with the index finger and thumb of the left hand and pull back slightly. In this position, the backup force of the system is high enough to allow the balloon to pass through even the most severe stenosis. In this video, the balloon is slightly inflated to create a relative stenosis and to master the anchor balloon technique. Normally, one should not attempt to pass a lesion with such a balloon.